Percy Lemtuke is in his mid-twenties, but he has already spearheaded an innovation that's improving the lives of Kenya's dairy farmers. Lemtukai's innovation is benefiting farmers like Andrew Lamunyarang from West Pokot County. His family's source of income comes from selling the milk he produces. The nearest milk collection station, however, is a few kilometers away. When the weather is hot, his milk spoils. But now, he can transport his product in this solar-powered cooler mounted on his motorbike. Lemtuk, who has a degree in informatics, developed the milk cooler with his business partner Emma Stella Wangoi. The two had noticed how hard it was for farmers to keep the milk fresh, transporting it in plastic cans trapped to donkeys. It's estimated that farmers in Kenya lose up to 2 billion liters of milk every year. Uh, that's when we were driven by the need to avail a solution that is now cooling system that is solar powered, uh, that will now counter the problem of food loss and, uh, and wastage at farm level. The aluminium containers can hold 100 litres of milk and keep it fresh for three days, all thanks to this innovative solar power system. As you can see, we have a lot of components. We have the power systems. We're using this small solar because we developed our own battery, a battery that can use the smallest amount of power. Technically, you can use 5 volt to charge it. With that small amount of power, you can easily use it in any, any region because dairy is normally associated with rain, rainy places. So at least with this, we can capture enough power to power the whole system. So it's entirely powered by solar. With a price tag of 850 euros, the system isn't cheap. Farmers can lease it through for about one and a half euros per full container of milk. The investment has paid off for Andrew Longunyarang, who is now able to get milk to the cooperative inter. <laughs> Mr. Truck, the cooler can weigh milk automatically. There is also an app that keeps track of milk prices and quantities delivered. The app technically captures all the collections, daily collections. That's a summary of the monthly collections, translated to, to um, uh, a figure so that the farmer knows exactly this is the amount of money I expect at the end of the, of the month, or this is exactly what I've been collecting throughout. Parsi Lemtuke's company, Savannah Sake Technologies, produces each and every component of the system. The innovation is currently being tested by 100 farmers in West Pokot, but for Parsi, that's not good enough. His plan is to roll it out countrywide before taking it out to the rest of East Africa. Wanja Mungai, West Pokot, Kenya.